Hi everyone, I'm Davy. where on my channel I do all things simple and thrifted living, DIYs, and homemaking. Today I'm going to share with you my simplicity of God's love and His faith through Jesus Christ. So this was an invitation put on by Happily Thriving Heidi and she invited me to join her and other people in this challenge to challenge you guys to um, find your faith, find your reason for living really. Um, there's been so many suicides and uh, murders and killings of policemen and um, we are just here to share that there is a reason for a living that um, for me personally there is a God who loves us and offers us grace if you accept that in him through Jesus Christ. Now the thing I do have to share with that is that we can't truly know his love unless we have faith in him. We have to believe that he, that God sent his son Christ to die on the cross and rise again for our sins. All humans are sinful. We are sinful people. Even as a Christian myself, I am a sinful person. I make mistakes, but I have to ask for God's forgiveness and His grace on a daily basis. It's not just something that you um, accept Christ and you live on your life as you used to. There are changes you have to make. And um, I looked up quite a few scripture verses that I kind of wanted to share with you. I will put them in the description box some are a little bit longer, but one in particular I wanted to read is this one. It's from Galatians 3.26. So in Christ Jesus, you are all children of God through faith. Isn't that just amazing? Like we are his children if we have faith in him. Like we know once we die that we're going to heaven and we are his children. He's making a place for us in heaven. I'm so passionate about this that you can just hear it in my voice. But um, this is what I believe and this is why I have a purpose to live. This is my reason to live is to live for him and to serve him in every single aspect of my life. Whether it be teaching music to my students, whether it be gardening in the afternoon, whether it be um, making videos for you guys. A couple other scripture passages that I'm going to mention are Romans 5, 1 through 5, Ephesians 3, 14 through 21, and Hebrews 11, 1. Now I'm going to also read Hebrews 11, 1 for you. Now faith is confidence in what we hope for and assurance about what we do not see. Faith is something that not be always factual. It's a trust. It's a belief. And we have to believe that God is love, but he's also just. There will be a judgment day for things that we have made mistakes for, but we have to trust and believe and be assured that he is true, that he is the one who loves us. So I will put those scripture verses all in the description box below. I hope this encourages you. And remember, this is what I believe, if I'm not pushing this on you, but I just wanted to share that as Heidi had invited us to share that with all of you guys. And I hope that you are encouraged today to find hope and to find God's love and to find peace in life. So with that, I hope you have a blessed and wonderful day and I will talk with you in my next video. Bye.